Thank you very much, Chuke. <clears throat> and now we'll continue with our next eulogy coming from Nadum Ejogo. Members of the esteemed Uche family of Azumini in Abia State, Nigeria, distinguished old boys of Government College, Umuahia, among whom are members of the class of 1972, to which Azuike Wabiai Emuche belonged, other distinguished guests attending this virtual service of songs in honor of our fallen son, husband, father, relative, classmate, schoolmate, friend, and I might add, great Omohe. In solemnity and solidarity, but with abiding faith in the almighty God for a life not defined by longevity, but blessed with substance and character. We are gathered to honor the husband of Mrs. Kate Emuche, father of Miss Chiamaka Emuche, son of the late Dr. Dick Emuche, who himself was an eminent alumnus of Government College Umuahia, and Lady Catherine Emuche, his mother, we are gathered to honor a brother to Dr. Chika Emuche, Ambassador Kechuku Emuche, Dr. Nena Eboda, Ms. Tandu Emuche, Mrs. Ngozi Dena, and Dr. Chichi Mwajei. We are gathered to honor a former scribe of the Beacon, the erstwhile House Magazine of Cousins House in Government College, Umaya, as well as the Chief Scribe of Umaya News Agency. We are gathered to honor a man admired by his classmates, friends, associates, and family for his orderliness and cleanliness, a quality which might have earned him the privilege of being appointed the kitchen representative of his house and meritoriously the cleanest boy honors on a number of occasions. Azul's tenure as kitchen representative was delightful to some of us. My trips from my house, Simpson House to Cousin's House, in search of fried plantain, my favorite food at the time, we are never in vain. We are gathered to honor a notable athlete who made a mark in long jump and triple jump competitions in his government college of Maya days. We have gathered to honor an alumnus of West Virginia University from where he obtained a bachelor's degree in business administration and a master's degree in agricultural economics and resource analysis. We have come together to honor a highly accomplished and cultured gentleman who rose through the ranks at the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation to become a general manager in one of its parastatals, the Nigerian Content Development and Monitoring Board. Ladies and gentlemen, we have come to honor our dear Azuike Wabiai Emuche, whom we, his friends, fondly called Wazinga. Azuike enhanced our humanity by making a difference and touching lives, especially in his community. I first experienced Azul's good-spiritedness in the aftermath of the demise of my own father, whom Dr. Emuche succeeded as Chairman Public Service Commission in the defunct East Central State. That poignant event was the genesis of a friendship of 48 years. Azul was always willing to share his privileges, but with the default mindset of an aversion to frivolities. To his friends and classmates, he was a calming influence and a voice of reason. But make no mistakes, 
he was a stickler for process and procedure who had little patience for disorder and dysfunctionality. We cannot forget that sense of humor which he deployed with a cynical smirk or smile or laughter at times. He was fittingly crowned the Grand Master of Humor in our class WhatsApp platform because of his witty and hilarious jokes. On a lighter note, it will be uncharacteristic of Azo and the mutual friends we share to allow any of us a free pass, even in this circumstance, and not call him out on some of the childhood escapades and mischief we all partook of which he sometimes spearheaded because he would not have hesitated to do the same. Wazinga, I will spare you and the audience the details, but remind you of just two things. The adventures with your little car, you know, a brown Datsun 120Y, which we only use for sightseeing, wherever you pick me from. Well, if anyone believes that, they will believe anything. I shall also remind you of that famous line in a few parties we attended in the U.S. in the 80s. I've got to make that move. There were many dimensions to Azul, and that variety gave fullness to his humanity. Our dear Wazinga, you faded away like the stars of the morning, losing their light in the glorious sun. But you will be remembered for the hearts you touched. You will be remembered for the inspiration you gave. You will be remembered for the work you have done. Your dear wife, daughter, mother, siblings, and close relatives, we encourage you to be comforted by the scripture in Joshua chapter 1, verse 9. Have I not commanded you to be strong and of good courage? Be not afraid and do not be dismayed. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. Rest peacefully in the bosom of the Lord, and may God be with you till we meet again. Amen. Thank you very much.